There's a building just past these rocks behind me. Maybe we should head that way. Ah, uh, those bloody mining rigs. What about them? The Skald is right to blame me for them. They were my idea. If you've got the time, they're in the bay just beyond this tunnel. I'd particularly appreciate us checking out the mining rigs in the lake to the right. You can see the smokestacks from here. But if you don't want to explore now, it looks like Derlin's place is through that open gate to the left. So, which way do we go? We could prepare more before rescuing Tyr. Up to you. Mimir, were you really the one who had those rigs built? Odin wanted the dwarves under his control, and, well, I convinced him he could buy their allegiance instead of demanding it outright. A trade agreement of sorts. That dragon sculpture is not bad. The first time someone's told me that, I suppose.
So not all dwarves can do that thing Brock and Sindri do. Maybe they just walk between realms and turn up somewhere else? Indeed, that's a rare skill. We gather one carefully cultivated by some secretive dwarven guild or other. Probably for the best. Them alone doing it isn't disconcerting enough. Huh, there's such a big bay, there's no fish. Must be because of the smoke from those mining rigs. Taking a break before visiting Durlin? Very wise. He can be... a lot. Pristine condition, too. Still here. What? The island near the geyser. We need to get the key from it and unlock this door. We need. I need. To set right a very old wrong. Don't want to draw the holes. We've got to clear out all these undead bats. <laughs>
Behind the door. A prisoner of sorts. <sighs> Atreus, you're looking awfully tall today. Hey, Sin. One of the mining rigs is here. See the smoke above us? That's where we're headed. Let's see if we can't shut it down. Chalk a block with materials that could help us. I'd grab whatever it spits up in the process. If the dwarves 
Rose agreed to the deal with Asgard, why do they blame you? I talked them into their own exploitation. They made their choice. Work or die is not a choice. I only made it seem so. What you just picked up there is pure Spartalfime ore. It won't be of use in the rig anymore, but perhaps our Huldra brothers could craft something from it. Father, is it always moral to kill something that's trying to kill you? Yes. Well, there you have it, lad. Bet we could swing across that, uh, lift thing. Gantry. Thanks. It's gotta be the right spot. Boost bottles. I smell fuel. Better. Oh, well experimented. Surprised the dwarves didn't shut these rigs off themselves. One or two tried. The Einher Yar made examples of them. They killed the dwarves? Couldn't you have convinced them not to? Aye. Ah! 
That should help. Yeah, that looks right.
Faymamir? To the blacksmiths of Svartalfheim, the creation of a weapon was a sacred thing. But Odin just wanted as many blades as he could get, as fast as he could get them. With every stolen resource or mediocre blade, the dwarves lost a bit of themselves. What you just picked up there is pure Svartalfheim ore. It won't be of use in the rig anymore, but perhaps our Huldra brothers could craft something from it. survived because of you. Ah, you're not wrong there, brother. Odin would have wiped out every last dwarf in Svartalfheim. If he couldn't use their skills, no one could. Whoa! Nice! Father, is it always moral to kill something that's trying to kill you? Yes. Well, there you have it, lad. <laughs> Should we get back to listing all the awful deeds of the Aesir gods? And there was Thrym the Cunning, the giant king who stole Thor's hammer. Odin traded him Freya to get it back, and sent Thor in disguise to murder his entire court. Ah, but enough of that for now. Is that pure Svartalfheim slag? Give it here! Come here. What's the deal with Odin's ravens? They can just transport him anywhere? Except for the realm between realms, thankfully. Why? Harder to find, thanks to dwarven enchantments and Yggdrasil's very own nature. Hmm. Lucky us. Smell the smoke? There's another mining rig here. You speak of your deeds with shame. Do you regret not allowing Odin to kill them? I don't. Stop them! Get it. The dwarves weren't chained up like the Loombacher. Couldn't they quit? I do what? Their newly built forges poisoned the soil of Svartalfheim. Unable to grow their own food, they had to buy it from Asgard. If they stopped working, they'd be taking food out of their own mouths. Ah! Oh, that's clever. And awful.
Seed to Moose Bahan. Think it might lead to that combat arena we visited years ago? What makes you say that? Wishful thinking, I guess. Going through Surtur's gauntlet, it was fun. It was training. Didn't have fun? <laughs> well, anyway, we should look for the other half of the seed. Since it's whole again, we can see where it leads. Land anything? Make it across. So meager a task done. A wee drop out of the Asgardian occupational bucket. You must live with your deeds, but do not be troubled by them, brother. Oh? And why not? You were given an impossible problem. Do not blame yourself for failing to solve it. I'm sure the dwarves would feel differently. This doesn't fix things. No, but it is a start. A reminder, brother. That Svartalfheim slag we collected could be of considerable use in the hands of Brock or Sindri. Ago, you mentioned Odin's ravens. What's the 
to stop him from using them to pop into existence and kidnap anybody he wants. Consent. The only way to travel by Odin's ravens is by your own choice. Oh, it's not so bad then. Look, the fish are coming back. Oh, so they are. 